Hey there! In this video, we'll go over your property's block list, which is a list of visitors that you do not want visiting your property. We'll also go over what to do in the event that a visitor triggers your list. Global admins will be able to edit your property's block list, while your property security admins will be able to view the block list. To get started, sign into the Envoy dashboard as a global admin. Navigate to Visitors. Select Block List from the left-hand menu. Select Add Records. Add a single record and upload a photo if applicable. Enter in all information for your block list entry. But keep in mind that photo files must be a JPEG or a PNG. Then select Save. You can also create records using a CSV upload. Instead of clicking on a single record, you will choose the option to import your CSV. When creating your CSV file, be sure to include the full name, any aliases, email addresses, phone numbers, keywords, physical descriptions, and reason for blocking. Be sure to separate each person out by a row in your file. Select your file as a CSV and upload it into your Envoy dashboard. Under the block list setting, navigate to alerts at the top of the page. Enter in the admin who needs to be notified in the event a block list notice is triggered. Admins must have a global admin role. Admins will receive an email or SMS notification. Email address and mobile phone number must be included in the global admins profile. Then select Save. In the event a block list record is triggered, a global admin will need to approve or deny the entry on the invites log under Visitors in order to complete the sign-in process. We've covered property block list and what to do in the event that your list is triggered. If you have any further questions, be sure to check out our help articles about Connect. And that's it for now. See you soon.